Welcome to a new video. In ancient times, statues were regarded as monuments of power, beauty, and divine worship. Behind these majestic sculptures made from marble, bronze, or wood often lie mysteries that have stood the test of time. Are you new to this channel? Make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell. And before we start, also like the video. Number 30. Ever wondered why no one's allowed to enter the torch of the Statue of Liberty? The dark answer lies hidden in an explosive night. Exactly 102 years ago, on July 30, 1916, Black Tom Island, an island in the New York Harbor, was rocked by a devastating explosion that shook the city. Windows shattered all over Manhattan, and unfortunately, seven lives were lost. Even the iconic Statue of Liberty was affected, resulting in the closure of the torch for future visitors. The National Park Service recognizes the Black Tom explosion as the reason for this measure, but why it still applies remains a mystery. Initially accusing fingers pointed at the workers on the island, as reported by the New York Times. But it wasn't until several years later that researchers uncovered the shocking truth. Germany amidst the war was behind the attack. However, why the torch remains inaccessible remains a puzzle. What do you think they might be hiding inside it? Number 29. Since childhood, Heather Andrews found gnomes a bit creepy, but when she accidentally dropped a ceramic garden gnome on her driveway and it broke, her aversion took an unexpected turn. What she discovered inside the broken gnome would leave her with more questions than answers. Upon closer inspection, Heather noticed a smaller statue discreetly attached at the bottom of the cracked gnome. The statue within a statue depicted the clothed body of a woman with an unusual twist. Her face bore the appearance of a bearded man. This mysterious discovery left her pondering its meaning and purpose. Was the figure inside her gnome meant to represent a woman or a man? Could it be an angel or a religious icon? The intriguing part is that the gnome in question, named Pete, originally had the shape of Santa Claus. A friend of Heather's bought the gnome for $20 at Target, a year before this incident. Number 28. In the following video, we see a statue in an unknown cemetery that suddenly tried to open its eyes on camera. Many people in the comments suggest that the video footage was edited by a computer and that it's fake. Others do believe it and say that the statue actually opened her eyes. The creator of the video suggests that the statue's eyes should be closed, but as we can see, the eyes appear to have been opened. Do you believe this? Could this photo have been photoshopped? Was the video edited? Or are we dealing with an unexplained phenomenon here? Number 27. In the picturesque Dutch town of Amersfoort, the Meander Medical Center unveiled an ancient mystery, a millennia-old Buddha statue that had been loaned to the Drents Museum. But this was no ordinary statue. Inside lay a mummy of a Buddhist monk, cherished in the lotus position. The gold-painted statue was carefully placed on a stretcher so that doctors could conduct an examination of what they called their oldest patient ever. The results were breathtaking. The monk's organs had been replaced by paper fragments covered with ancient Chinese characters and other mysterious materials. However, how the organs had been removed remained a puzzle. The body inside the statue is believed to be that of the Buddhist master Lu Quan, who died around the year 1100. Why his remains were buried in this ancient Chinese statue remains a mystery. Some believe that monks, driven by a desire for eternal life, practiced self-mummification, mummifying their own bodies over decades. Number 26. Deep in the heart of Singapore lies a unique cultural treasure that takes you on an epic journey through the afterlife. Hao Par Vila, a sprawling 2.4 square miles, enchants visitors with its stunning mix of mythology, folklore, and a touch of horror. Established in 1937 by Chinese Burmese businessman Ao Boon Hao, the park is a tribute to his brother. What truly sets the park apart are the more than 1,000 statues and 150 life size dioramas that adorn the grounds. Inspired by Chinese legends and tales, these artistic wonders offer a fascinating glimpse into a world of wonders. While some scenes depict cheerful Buddhas, others translate transport you to dark realms full of gruesome scenes. You'll see boys being devoured by terrifying creatures and terrifying punishments awaiting in the afterlife, according to Taoist and Buddhist beliefs. Locally, Hao Par Villa is known as a mysterious place. Do you dare to enter this extraordinary world of wonders and horrors? Number 25. A religious person was attending church on Good Friday, somewhere in Santa Ana, Mexico, and if you look closely, suddenly in the background, the statue of Jesus moves. After the video footage was posted on the internet, many people believe the head of Jesus appears to move. However, the movement would be so small that it would be difficult to notice. If we zoom in, however, you might see it more clearly that the head was suddenly bent downward. According to some people, it's possible that the wreath on the head of the statue fell down and thus created a false impression. 
The priest of the church is not sure. On the one hand, he believes that something miraculous had happened, but it could also be that the head of the statue had collapsed a bit. Even so, I think it's a mysterious event for this almost 300-year-old statue. Number 24 Researchers at the Altus Museum in Berlin have made an intriguing discovery about the famous Egyptian Queen Nefertiti. Using advanced medical technology, including a CT scan, they delved beneath the stucco of her 3,300-year-old bust. What they found was truly astonishing. Beneath the thick layers of stucco, the researchers uncovered a beautifully detailed stone carving of Nefertiti's face, different from the external stucco face she is known for. Previously, it was thought that the underlying stone merely served as structural support, but the scan revealed a masterpiece that had remained hidden for centuries. The stone face displayed delicate details not visible in the stucco, such as subtle creases at the corners of the mouth and a slight bump on the nose. This discovery added a lifelike dimension to the ancient queen's features. Additionally, Nefertiti's cheekbones appeared more accentuated in the stucco, enhancing her regal allure. Nefertiti, the wife of Pharaoh Akhenaten, is believed to have been a powerful ruler, possibly wielding significant power during her reign from 1370 BC to 1330 BC. Number 23. Jason DeCaris Taylor is a British sculptor who has two passions, sculptures and the sea. He combined these two interests and created the most unique sculpture park in the world. The underwater sculpture park, as it was called, is located off the west coast of Granada and has become an underwater museum for divers around the world. Because the statues have been at the bottom of the sea for a long time, it has become somewhat of a place for the underwater life that lives there. However, it's said that the statues have also changed shape from time to time. In this photo, the statue even seems to have eyes, which looks pretty creepy. Could these statues really move? Of course, because the statues are in the water for a long time, it's possible that sometimes they appear to move or change. This is probably due to the conditions of the salinity in the water and the growth of the sea creatures and everything around them. Number 22. Deep within the expanse of a salt lake in Western Australia lies a haunting and enchanting scene awaiting adventurous souls. In this arid landscape stand 51 sculptures scattered about, each a sinister portrayal of local indigenous Australians. These statues, created by British artist Anthony Gormley, form the Inside Australia Project. Unveiled in 2003 at Lake Ballard, some 500 miles northeast of Perth, the project marked the 50th anniversary of the Perth International Art Fair, the oldest of its kind in the country. Despite more than 12 years passing since its unveiling, these steadfast steel figures still cast mysterious shadows over the salt lake. Amidst the dazzling white expanse, the sculptures present a striking contrast. Antony found inspiration for these sculptures by spending time with local Aboriginal communities. Here, individuals volunteered to be scanned to create digital contours for the artwork. These contours were then transformed into the eerie statues that now adorn Lake Ballard. Can you imagine walking through this desert and not realizing these are modern works of art? Number 21. A chilling discovery rattled those mistaking it for the Lord of Patience statue in Mexico. During restoration work on this ancient icon, an x-ray revealed a spine-tingling secret. Deep within were eight perfectly preserved human teeth. This ominous find, unearthed during maintenance of the statue dating back to the 18th century, raised eyebrows and quickened heartbeats. The teeth, fully intact and visible down to the root on the x-ray, raised questions about their origin and significance. Some speculate that believers donated them as a form of gratitude or devotion to the religious icon. While statues sometimes have teeth, they are typically made of materials like wood or bone. These teeth, however, are undeniably human. The Lord of Patience statue, standing at 5 foot 10, depicts a patient in suffering Christ, anchored in a church in San Bartolo Cuatlapan, a remote town north of Mexico City. With this unexpected discovery, the mystery surrounding the statue and its teeth remains unsolved. Number 20. This statue of the Virgin Mary stands somewhere in the town of Metin in northwestern Argentina and is owned by Rosana Mendoza Frias and her family. The red spot you see in the face of the figure is thought to be blood tears that come from Virgin Mary when she cries. According to the family, they would have witnessed several times when the statue started crying. In April of 2017, the statue began to cry tears of blood, and since then, this has inexplicably happened more than 38 times. When the woman had posted a picture of the statue on the internet, the next day there were 7,000 people who wanted to take a closer look at the statue. Some were believers, while others were curious if the stories had really happened. Because so many people showed up, the statue was placed in a glass case to protect it. Number 19. 
Stare at a statue long enough and it almost seems like it's looking back at you, perhaps even coming to life and wandering off at night. A Mexican legend whispers about such ominous tales. In the heyday of the fast food chain, Ronald McDonald was the embodiment of the brand. But in recent years, his presence has dwindled dramatically. Now you won't see him anywhere in McDonald's establishments. The mysterious disappearance of Ronald McDonald coincided with a chilling incident in an abandoned parking lot in Wisconsin. In August 2016, disturbing statues of terrifying clowns appeared on social media, initially mistaken for advertising for an upcoming horror movie. But soon the photos spread like wildfire around the world after catching the attention of news outlets. Just a month later, creepy clowns surfaced in Canada as well as Australia and the United Kingdom, causing a huge panic. Disturbing stories followed, such as a family in Florida being attacked by a gang of 20 clowns, and another incident where a boy was chased to school by someone wearing a clown mask. Number 18. Among the many mysteries of Egypt, one stands out above all the others, the Great Sphinx of Giza. This gigantic statue, built nearly 4,500 years ago, continues to intrigue to this day. But what archaeologists have recently discovered is causing even more excitement. A secret chamber beneath the Sphinx. Within the complex of the Great Sphinx lies countless passageways, tunnels, and chambers, each with its own mystery. But it's the recently discovered chamber that is now garnering all the attention. Hidden near the chest of the Sphinx lies an iron door in the ground concealed between the monument's paws. According to ancient tales, this chamber could be the Hall of Records, a legendary library buried beneath the Sphinx and the Pyramids of Giza. It's said that this hall contains vast knowledge of ancient Egypt, preserved in ancient scrolls. Some even believe that answers to the question of whether extraterrestrial beings were involved in the construction of the pyramids and the Sphinx may be found here. Number 17. This is one of the most famous videos of moving statues on the internet. In the video, we see the Hindu goddess Lord Kalika following the camera with her eyes. However, many people think that this was an optical illusion created by the hollow eyes of the statue. This also reminded me a bit of a video I had seen of a T-Rex illusion. So it's said that the sculptor of the Lord Kalika statue used some sort of similar technique to accomplish this. However, others say that the statue has higher powers because she's said to have four arms. In other depictions, she sometimes even has ten arms. In Indian culture, she also usually has a blue color, which makes her quite mysterious. Number 16. Carved from mammoth ivory, this statue, believed to be 40,000 years old, towers at a height of 12 feet. It blends the head of a cave lion with a part human body. The figure stands with slightly apart legs while the arms stretch to the sides of a slender, feline body. This ancient artwork hails from a world beyond our everyday reality and represents a being that exists beyond physical form, a symbolic embodiment of supernatural concepts. Discovered in 1939 in a cave in present-day South Germany, the traces of wear indicate that it was held, passed on and touched, seeking revelations about its meaning and purpose. It was crafted from mammoth ivory, reflecting its ancient environment, a time when mammoths roamed and the cave lion traversed the land. The Staddle Cave, where the statue was found, was even more mysterious, facing north and devoid of sunlight, unsuitable for human habitation. Did the lion man represent a deity, a manifestation of a creation story, or a human transformed during a cosmic journey? to communicate with supernatural beings. Number 15. In ancient Japanese Nara, a city steeped in history, archaeologists made an exciting discovery that captivates the imagination. Deep within a centuries-old Buddha statue, the Manju Bosatsu of the Hokuji Temple, several mysterious scrolls and artifacts were found, hidden from the world for many centuries. The Hokuji Temple, a bastion of Buddhism built in the 8th century, was a center of spiritual activity in ancient Nara. Inside this temple stood the humble statue of Manju Bosatsu, only 29 inches resting in silence over the years. No soul suspected that this modest figure would harbor such a treasure trove of historical artifacts. Manju Bosatsu, a bodhisattva, symbolizes the noble endeavor to help others escape suffering. A CT scanner revealed that the head of the statue contained about 30 objects, while another 150 artifacts were hidden in the torso each with its own story and significance. This discovery raises countless questions. Why were these artifacts hidden in the statue, and how did they fade into oblivion over the centuries? Even the head priest of the Hokuji Temple was unaware of the treasures hidden within the Manju Bosatsu. Number 14. Several witnesses have reported that not one, but several Buddha statues in the shopping mall of Kuala Lumpur suddenly started moving. This was also captured on camera, and we see that the mouths and eyes move, and some sort of bright white light comes over the statue. Many people claim that the video footage had not been tampered with, and that this had really happened. 
The unexplained phenomenon happened from 5 to 6 p.m. on February 27, 2011. A monk who was nearby says he saw a light coming off the statue, followed by an unexplained sound that seemed to come from another dimension. Some people say that other statues that were outside also began to move. I have no idea if we should believe these people. After all, skeptics say this could never happen. Do you believe this? Let me know in the comments. Number 13. In the National Archaeological Museum of Madrid stands the intriguing Lady of Elche, with her penetrating gaze and mysterious aura. This ancient limestone bust, discovered in 1897 in Valencia, has captivated archaeologists for over a century and has sparked lively debates. Countless theories have emerged about the meaning of this mysterious statue. Some see her as a Moorish queen, others as a witch, or even as a visitor from outer space. However, archaeologists are convinced that she is a unique representation of the Carthaginian mother goddess Tanit, used in antiquity as a funerary urn. The authenticity of the Lady of Elche has been disputed throughout history, with rumors of forgery. In 2011, advanced research techniques confirmed the authenticity of the statue, revealing traces of ash with fragments of human bone, dated to over 2,500 years old. It also matched the ancient Iberian period, but who she truly was remains a mystery. Number 12. In ancient Egypt, cats were not just seen as pets, but as sacred beings believed to bring good fortune to anyone who cuddled them. It's fascinating to see how seriously they took their feline friends. Researchers discovered a cat mummy in a cat sarcophagus, now on display at the Manchester Museum. Imagine, wealthy Egyptian families adorned their cats with bling and treated them to tasty treats. And if such a furry friend passed away, it wasn't just any sadness, it was seriously intense. Their owners were so distraught that they shaved their eyebrows, and they waited for their eyebrows to grow back before they stopped mourning. And you know what's the craziest part? If you accidentally killed a cat in ancient Egypt, you get the death penalty. Ancient Egyptians also seriously believed their gods could chill in cats. So they mummified these felines as a tribute to the gods. That's why there was even a whole business around breeding and mummifying these special animals. But they were symbols of divine protection. Number 11. Snow White is probably one of the most beloved Disney princesses in the world. But the kids who live in Boco de la Rio, Mexico, and have seen the following video find Snow White rather creepy. This is because there's a statue in the Kingdom Park that is said to move. In the following video footage from a Mexican TV program, we see that they managed to capture a supernatural event on camera. Just looking at the statue could send shivers down your spine. At one point, the camera zooms in towards Snow White's eyes, and then you see her eyes blink. The cameraman reportedly said that he was terrified and very shocked after this happened. Since the park opened in 1988, several ghost sightings have been also reported by locals. In fact, before it became a park, it was a private cemetery of the family that lived there. Number 10. In 2016, art connoisseurs in Australia stumbled upon a real treasure as they prepared an old wooden statue for auction. Hidden inside the sculpture, they discovered a unique find, a rare paper banknote from the Ming Dynasty of China. This banknote, creased but still intact, dates back to the third year of Emperor Zhu Wenzhang's reign, corresponding to the year 1371 in the Western calendar. What makes this banknote so remarkable are the stern warnings to potential counterfeiters printed in Chinese characters, proclaiming that the punishment for forgery is nothing less than decapitation. It was clear that the Ming Dynasty didn't joke about counterfeiting. The banknote was cleverly concealed within a wooden sculpture depicting the head of a Luohan, an important figure in Chinese Buddhism. This suggests that the statue was once part of a family or a public temple. The inscriptions on the banknote and the official seals in red and black ink mark it as a valuable piece, designated as a great Ming treasure note, with a value of one guan. It's truly astonishing to think that this banknote remained hidden inside the ancient Chinese statue for over 600 years. This gives us a fascinating glimpse into the customs and rituals of that time, where small offerings like this paper banknote were used as religious gifts. Number 9. In Verona, Italy, stands the bronze statue of Juliet, whispered to bring luck and love if you touch her breast. But the quest for romantic happiness has inadvertently caused more than just love miracles. The beloved statue, once a symbol of romance, has been temporarily removed from Verona due to all the touches. Thousands of hopeful hearts touching the statue have damaged it, now requiring restoration. As experts carefully lifted it from its medieval spot, believed to be the home of Shakespeare's young heroine, they made a surprising discovery. People had wedged their love letters and keys from padlocks into the cracks of the statue. Through years of rubbing, the cracks had widened, creating space for visitors to tuck their love messages inside. 
The original statue, cast in 1969, had already suffered considerable damage. But among the cracks, they also found padlock keys. Lovesick couples would buy padlocks, engrave their names on them, and throw away or hide the key in a secret place, hoping for eternal love. Number 8. The next statue is the Shrine of Our Lady of Tapao, located in Tapao, a pilgrimage site in Vietnam. The believers have to climb a staircase of nearly 400 steps to admire the statue up close. Like many shrines and temples, it's claimed that many miracles have happened in this area, such as divine apparitions and miraculous healings. One of these miracles is said to have been captured on camera. The quality of the video footage isn't clear, but if you look closely, the cloak which is around the statue moves. In my opinion, the video footage looks credible. This may also be because the people in the background were really surprised when Mary made her presence felt. Do you believe this? Uh, by the way, if you pay attention to the trees, you can see that there's no wind in the area at this time either. Number 7. For years, rumors swirled about a hidden treasure within the Armillosphere, a famous sculpture in Las Vegas. And finally, the mystery was unveiled. There was indeed something unusual about the bosom of one of the mermaids. Further inspection revealed that her breasts had been added separately after the original construction, creating a striking anomaly on one of the most photographed sculptures on the Strip. The reason behind this hidden addition was disclosed by Tolan Grinnell, the modern artist tasked with creating the work. He explained that he was commissioned to create a piece that would perfectly fit the Renaissance theme of the hotel. Inspired by his love for Las Vegas, with its blend of high and low culture, the fusion of old and new, and its accessible nature, he eagerly set to work. Importantly, Grinnell had never intended to keep the addition a secret. On December 5, 2014, as part of the Ultima weekend at the Venetian, selected visitors were given the chance to behold the hidden work. The hidden masterpiece that emerged was a vibrant, three-dimensional diorama made of wood, resin, paint, and various other materials, depicting the picturesque canals of Venice. Number 6. Neb Senu is a 4,000-year-old Egyptian statue in the Manchester Museum that was reportedly captured on camera as it moved and even spun around. Because the statue is 4,000 years old, people believe it has magical powers. How else could it be explained that this 25-centimeter statue moved? The story tells that this statue was created in the year 1800 as a vase for the soul of an Egyptian man. After the video footage was uploaded, it went viral pretty quickly, with many people unable to explain it. Several experts who examine the video footage say that the statue moved due to the vibrations of nearby pedestrians walking past it. Do you believe this, or could there be something more mysterious going on? Let me know in the comments. Number 5. In Jordan lies Ain Gazelle, meaning Spring of the Gazelle, a site full of archaeological treasures dating back to 7250 BC. In the era of hunters and gatherers, it's a magical place where history whispers and where stone statues seem to come to life. In this ancient site, 32 statues have been discovered, tucked away in two secret caches. Some of these statues are nearly human-sized and appear to be composed of different parts, as if they were once part of an enchanting puzzle. It is believed that these statues played a significant role in ancient rituals and ceremonies. Perhaps they were used to honor ancestors, ward off evil spirits, or even to represent gods. Some statues even have two heads, reminiscent of ancient legends about twin gods. Additionally, they tell us stories from a time long ago, a time of mystery and magic, and that there are still many secrets waiting to be discovered. Number 4. A towering 13-feet statue of the Virgin Mary has been placed in the crystal clear waters around Bohol, Philippines, as a powerful weapon against the destructive practice of dynamite fishing. This impressive statue is strategically positioned on the reef to put an end to harmful methods employed by local fishermen, such as the use of explosives and cyanide. These destructive practices not only cause damage to the fragile coral reef, but also result in massive mortality among marine life. Fishermen only retrieve the desired fish from the water and leave the rest to rot. Despite these traditional fishing techniques being deeply rooted in local culture, they are increasingly seen as a threat to nature. Local Catholic priests emphasize the importance of stewardship and the responsibility to protect our planet. The Statue of Our Lady is considered the patron saint of the reef, a safe haven for all life, both human and animal. The presence of the statue has also brought about a remarkable change in behavior among fishermen. Out of respect for the Virgin Mary, they now refrain from damaging the reef. Number 3. The Temple of Sai Baba in India is visited by thousands of pilgrims each year. Sai Baba is known to have performed miracles. 
His followers claim that after praying in his temple, Sai Baba often appeared in their dreams and gave them advice. Therefore, his followers were not at all surprised when they saw a video in which the statue seems to move. According to many people, this event belonged to the long list of miracles performed by Sai Baba. If you look closely, you can see that the pendulum hanging over Sai Baba moves plaintively. But that's not all, it seems that the statue is also breathing. Perhaps the scariest part is that the pendulum also falls on the ground. Pretty creepy if you ask me. Number 2 An ancient 18th century Jesus statue has unveiled a hidden treasure trove of secrets. While restoring this century's old artwork, experts stumbled upon a mysterious note from 1777, tucked inside the statue like a time capsule. The note, presumably penned by priest Joaquin Minguez, sheds fascinating light on daily life 300 years ago. From mundane activities to political and religious matters, the document provides insights into Spanish life at that time. Discovered by craftsmen from the Madrid-based art restoration company Da Vinci Restauro, the note was concealed within the hollow interior of the wooden statue. This valuable artifact, located in the Church of Santa Agueda in the village of Saltillo de la Ribera, is now not only a religious symbol, but also a keeper of secrets from the past. The fact that the sculptor intentionally incorporated two small compartments into the artwork, known as permaninos, adds even more mystery to the story. Number 1 The iconic Moai statues of Easter Island are an intriguing mystery that has puzzled us for a long time. While we usually associate them with enormous impressive heads protruding above the landscape, it turns out that these statues actually have full bodies. A surprising discovery that changes our understanding of these ancient sculptures. The Moai, crafted by the Rapa Nui people, are situated on a remote Easter Island, surrounded by the beautiful waters of the Pacific Ocean. Carved from the island's native rock, these monolithic statues date back to a period between 1100 and 1500 AD. Over time, the bodies of the Moai were slowly buried underground leaving only their characteristic heads protruding above the surface. Researchers made even more remarkable discoveries during their study. On the backs of the Moai, they found etched rock drawings, including symbols representing Polynesian canoes, possibly a tribute to the sculptor's family. Furthermore, they found traces of red pigment at nearby burial sites, suggesting that the Moai were once painted red, perhaps for ceremonial purposes. These new insights shed a fascinating light on the rituals and customs of the Rapa Nui people. The notion that the Moai have full bodies and were associated with community burial sites make these statues even more mysterious than they already were. What do you consider the most mysterious statue secret? Let me know in the comments. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos we've made, click one on the screen or take a look at the channel. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.